The Kuomintang officially nominated Deputy Legislative Speaker Sophie Hong as its presidential candidate during its National Congress on July 19th. During her speech, Hong reiterated her adherence to the party's platform, including the 1992 consensus. Meanwhile, KMT Chairperson Eric Chu and President Ma Ying-jeou questioned Democratic Progressive Party presidential candidate Tsai Ing-wen's policy of maintaining the status quo pointing out that it is merely a vision with no substance. The Kuomintang held its National Congress on July 19. During the Congress, the delegates approved Deputy Legislative Speaker Sophie Hong's nomination as the party's presidential candidate in a show of unity with a thunderous standing ovation. This nomination put an end to months of speculation about Hong's candidacy. During her speech, Hong said that if she is elected, she will adhere to the 1992 consensus. This statement showed that her political platform and the party's political platform are one and the same. KMT Chairperson Eric Drew presided over the National Congress, while President Ma ying attended in his capacity as a party member. Also in attendance were former chairpersons Lian Zhen and Wu Boshong, as well as Legislative Speaker Wang Jingping. During their remarks, both Drew and Ma reiterated their commitment to using the 1992 consensus to further cross-strait relations. They also questioned Democratic Progressive Party presidential candidate Tsai Ing-wen's cross-strait policy of maintaining the status quo, saying it is vague and unclear. Meanwhile, outside the Congress venue, many of Hong's supporters had gathered to show their support. Following the conclusion of the Congress, Hong walked outside to thank them. She also promised to do her utmost to defend the Republic of China if elected.